I expect you to learn um, to get a deeper understanding of how geoinformation can be used for work in the field and also how information is processed, which is um, gathered in the field and then how the information is used at the headquarter office. It's been a really great course. Uh, it's sort of the combination of the practical side of how to use ArcGIS, but uh, really tied to why you use it in a certain way in disasters in order to convey the message that you need to convey. UNOSAT is a center of excellence for satellite imagery analysis, innovative geospatial solutions, and applied research to the United Nations and its member states. Thanks to the practical experience of the UNOSAT training team, we are able to transfer our knowledge to member states and sister agencies, thereby equipping them to use the latest GIS and remote sensing solutions for a wide range of applications. As of 2014, Almost 2,000 professionals from 45 different countries have been trained on the use of geospatial information technology within different application domains. UNOSAT also works with the research community to transfer knowledge related to disaster response directly to the affected populations and member states. What it has enabled us to do is to be able to design projects that we could not design before. It's opened up a lot of avenues that we didn't know were an option before the training. I'm using the training I obtained from UNOSAT to convert uh, the Greater Horn of Africa Climate Outlook Forum maps from a picture format into GIS shape files, which enables me to combine it with other data sets such as elevation and vegetation cover for applications in agriculture and the health sector. Our course materials are constantly updated to incorporate participant feedbacks as well as the latest tools and technologies. It was a very interactive methodology and very practical orientated. This was a great experience and very important to really learn how to work with the program. It is a very practical training, definitely hands-on, and uh, you get to learn a lot by doing things. And it is probably the best way to to get these kind of competencies. It's been really good and really hands-on, which is nice. It's a nice balance of lectures and practical exercises um, and sort of guided learning and self-directed learning. UNOSAT gives utmost importance to the interaction during the training as the participants bring a huge amount of invaluable experience to the table. We could really learn from each other, both from technical expertise or from field experience. There was a very positive exchange that was also supported by the teachers and the facilitators. Most of the people coming to UNOSAT learning events are people with a great field experience, with a big ground in disaster management, and it's also for us an opportunity to learn from them. I think that uh, going away with some concrete skills to produce maps has been uh, and actually being able to do it in practice and you know, show a very good map has been, uh, has been quite, quite impressive in, in only two weeks. <laughs>